So he's out of practice, and we're going to do something we haven't done for a bloody, bloody long, long time. Yes, go shopping, or browsing, and mm. things, and stuff. Video game looking, it's a new series. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we're yeah. going to head off to... Where are we going? Canterbury. Mm. You guys have never seen that place before, have you? No. No, no. But anyway, here's some scenery. Hmm. Game certainly looks different. It's now a doner kebab shop. It's the, we're actually going like around one of the back streets to like a new shopping centre in Canterbury we've never actually been down. They have stuff. Lots of stuff. Yeah. Flying tiger, Copenhagen. No, it's Menkind. The Menkind places now everywhere. They have like video game stuff, you know, like Xbox clocks. It's the old bus station. Small ones. That window says, we're going to sun fade everything. <laughs> yes. Everything will fade. There are three monkeys on there. Here we will see the oh, All right, yeah. Cool, cool. Now look, there's one of our greatest fans. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. It's been a long time since we've been out in the public. Sweets. Lots and lots of sweets. Oh, yeah. <laughs> it is, isn't it? Look, there's a sunglasses hut. And summers. Sports Direct and Tesco. Across from the new huge Primark, which used to be BHS. Oh look, we're in the Marlow Arcade now. Shop hunting. Look, you're still alive. Are you still alive? Yes, just about. <laughs> yes. There is no gaming shops or anything. Oh look, there's a Hobbs. Is there a Shores? Oh, mind you, there's a HMV down there. An antique shop. And a sea salt from Cornwall. There we have, HMV. They're actually about to open 200 new stores. We going in? Yeah, got a lot. Yeah. In we go. All the BTS stuff is in here. Right, well, we've just come out of Primark. Yeah. Right, well, we just come out of HMV and we asked to film and they were like, no, thanks for asking, but no. And it kind of really, really sucks because inside they do have loads and loads of stuff related to gaming. Um, they've gone anime mad. K-pop mad. Oh, it has lots of alien stuff because aliens is owned by Disney now, and you can <laughs> notice it. Oh boy! Yeah, aliens backpack, t-shirts, uh, lunchbox, <laughs> stickers. There was those big yeah. cool stickers. And they had like a clearance section with like um, obviously clearance items, which were all like four ninety nine or fourteen ninety nine, which yeah. isn't really clearance prices. <laughs> but it's cheaper than <laughs> But I mean, HMV, if there's one in your town, definitely worth checking out, but it's so different to what it was. So it is majority K-pop now, yeah. definitely K-pop. But upstairs in the Canterbury one, it's all vinyl. And as soon as you get there, you get whisked well, back to the 80s. They've got CDs as well, but it's like, you look oh, at yeah. the vinyl, you look at like, so Metallica, they had the Master of Puppets there, it's like 35 pounds. And you're like, <laughs> whoa, I just listened to it on YouTube, you know? Yeah, where's Spotify? <laughs> Well, we right. think it's on. Yeah, we think it's on. <laughs> can't it see anything in the red light. Red light. Yeah. So. We're at a um, destination we haven't been for how long? A while. Yeah. So um, Two years. It's going to be... I think you're on camera. I just can't tell. I am. It's going to be really good to actually get in and catch up. I can see him already. So, here we go. P60 and it looks like a Halo Pokeball egg. It does look like a Halo Pokeball, doesn't it? Mm -hmm. Tried sticks galore. The old SNES sticks, big pile yeah. of old SNES sticks. Uh, it's at Games Mega Drive. Yes. <laughs> oh, but they're all right, they are. What was their quality testing? Yeah. <laughs> the spongy joypad. Hello. It's a stranger. <laughs> okay, so we're in the shop and it's been too, too long years. 
and um, yeah, it's pretty awesome. Let's have a look, see what we've got. Lots of Sega Saturn with lots of light on them. Dreamcast. Yeah. We noticed the arcade yeah. machines have gone. Yes, there's more space. Yes. And the famous cabinets everybody wants to look at. Dun dun. Modelled by our very own Tony. <laughs> Are you going to pick the car or the jackpot? Uh, uh, I'll do that. So you know. <laughs> yeah. Here we have to put it CDI for fifty. <laughs> It has crap controls. <laughs> they are literally the worst. I thought it looks like it's got a place from that. Good. I've just finished that on the switch. A couple more behind there. One of the tactics. Yeah. Lots of Pokemon. Didn't know that came out on the Game Boy. Animal Crossing figures. That is the Animal Crossing? Yeah, that is awesome. Makes me glad I haven't bought my daughter so I have no money. I know, it's one of the few things. Would you be interested in a box collection we'll come at of Sub -Zero. the um, Zelda Breath of the Wild and all those? Yes. Um, oh look, we have our cheaper uh, section uh, down here. I don't have a full box. I've got uh, 2600. Okay. And uh, like... Yeah, no. Box like, like, iPen 64. Sure. Um, definitely. Um, I mean, yeah, ping us a message. Was Amazing was game. Really Oh, you might as well play the book or what have you. Cool Mario Watch. Game and Watch. Super Nintendo. Pokemon section and lots of boxes. Oh, lots of Pokemon, Pokemon cards? Pokemon cards are, are the new thing. Yes, they're very hot, especially in our area. My nephew lives on them. <laughs> yeah. Well, that's one of the reasons why we sold the arcades, actually, is to make room yeah. for the tables for people to use. There's <laughs> so to... much more space, it's like, it feels twice as big now, doesn't yeah. it? But it's been so long. Mm -hmm. It has been way too long. Spectrums. <laughs> Just the boxes, yeah? Yeah. yeah. Boxes always look good though. <laughs> Loads of GameCube. Mr. Tony, how are you? Not too bad, mate. Not too bad. Now, now sort of like some of the Crazy to semi over, you know what I mean? Yeah. <laughs> semi over, yeah. yeah. For now, for now, temporarily. No, no, no. Guys and books down there. Not yet. <laughs> Good to see you again, my friend. Safe journeys. Take care. As we always do with our days out, it's food time. And what do you have, Tony? I have the vegan burger, as I am being veggie at the Let's moment. Let's have a look. So, uh, actually, it looks well, nice. I'm not being veggie, look. It looks well, I nice. have that one. Mmm. We're in KFC. Uh, right, well, we've finished our food. Um, we're going to have a look in CX and then we're bringing our journey for the day to an end. But KFC was awesome. How was your burger? It was tasty. It was tasty. It was tasty and murder free. Mm. <laughs> Unlike mine. <laughs> Many chickens died to bring you this meal. <laughs> I think there was only one chicken to be honest. The meal wasn't big enough to have multiple chickens. <laughs> Look! Much 
past the system. Dreamcast. More master system. And Tony. So Tony's going. Bye bye. Yeah, I'm going to continue on for uh, looking one more place. So, how are you thinking today, then, mate? Yeah, been fun, been fun. Not much mm. to look at and stuff, but there's been some decent bits and stuff. Been some amazing some, bits. Alex had some <laughs> really, really nice content. He didn't have like that much stuff. But everything he had was good. Yeah, it's all kind of concentrated into quality really nice over stuff. quantity. Um, it's the best we've seen that shop. I'd say in three years because we haven't seen it in three years, yeah. but for a long, long time. Yeah, yeah. Went in there, and if it was us six years ago, we would have come out with bags. Yes. yes. Yeah. There was so much stuff, and if if you're new to collecting, really good prices as well. Yeah. Boxed, boxed SNES stuff, you know, in there. Great really prices, good. really, really good yeah. prices. Yeah. And the amount of Master System, and that Master System, that Master System at CEX. Yeah. But none of them had manuals, well, the one I wanted anyway. <laughs> but CEX was just a disappointment. It was like this wave of more Master System games than ever. And then it's like, no, the one I wanted, no manual. And But yeah, um, but, you know, you had so much Saturn and Dreamcast. And, but if we've gone in there before, it's been like, the FIFAs hmm. and just nothing else, but yeah, so definitely get yourself over to level up games, hmm. or don't. It's up to you, really. Yes. <laughs> yeah. But if you're into collecting, then good prices. He has good stuff. It's good, and he has lots out the back. Didn't film any, but he let me go at the back, and it's been a while since I've been at the back of one of his shops, and there was lots Pulled of down really, curtain. really, really good stuff. Really good stuff there. Street Fighter Alpha, isn't it? Yeah. Curtain. Yeah. But anyway, it has been fun. It has been a great day. It's. Yeah. It's been good, so mm. uh, I'm going to get off and uh, leave you to it. Yeah. See you soon, buddy, and I'll be back. So, here I am, guys. I'm finally in Dover. Time to check out Game Base. It is literally in the corner, CEX, just across the road from there. There's an old home Right. Huge. Can't even get her in. Demetri Scoot. This is the old uh, cabinets. The collectors are going to be hitting. Down there. Some nares. Super nares. NES. Mega Drive, PlayStation and Xbox. We hit down here. This is obviously all the PlayStation stuff. Is that the display stand? This is the new stuff. And obviously, as you can hear from the background, E is a bit of a busy shop. That's if you could even hear me through this mask. It's got such a lot of cool stock packed into the shop. Pre-owned section. Vita, PSP, I'm going too fast, I apologise, it's really hot, I'm wearing my jacket and sweating. Some more PS3, and the original PS1, nuclear strike. We're at the Nintendo section. We preview coming soon games. And he just generally has lots of stuff. Regular stop rotation as always. But you guys know that. And um, let's just hope the music in the background isn't one. Oh yes. Uh, mini packs. Second hand section. Do we? Wii U, Pokemon, 
Ava Max in the background, the Warhammer section, with lots of reflections. Obviously, you build and paint your own figures. And then move over to the Relive Retro section. And you guys know where the pause button if you wanted to slow down. But it's a busy place, so I film what I can when I can. Smallish retro section. That's where my um, Mega Terracom was a few weeks back. I haven't played Dead and enjoyed it. Let's end up down here. GameCube games. So we go. New releases. Pre-order on the Xbox, up to the pre-owned. And the cabinet. Oh look, Tombi. That's Tombi 2, Mega Man X, is it X6? I can't, no, can't make it out. Fox Mega CD, Mega CD 2, and Starlink, which is everywhere. Our system 2, oh, I've got another Mega CD 3 box. But this is the, no, new or pre-owned Xbox actually, this is the other side. I finally got a chance to look here. But basically, this is just going to be a quick preview today, guys, for the big proper video where I can do spend some serious time in the shop, get everything properly. Just give you an idea of what's here. The elite PC gaming. And uh, Mortal Kombat. Apparently, Pokemon's coming soon. They're frozen. So on the channel, you've heard me for years ago talk about this guy, Jimmy. Hey. Hi guys. Hi. I've known him ever since he's worked here. How long ago? Game station. Yeah. Game. Yeah. A long, long ass time. And now he's got his own. Well, your partner, isn't you? No, it's me. Is it? Is his own? Oh, yeah. there we go. So if yeah. you want the money, there it is. <laughs> yeah, absolutely. Uh, I yeah. Took over for me when I left game. So yeah, did me own, decided to do my own thing. Um, and yeah, two years in the making. Yeah. Got a game in the now. So other than the games, yeah, you've got Games Arena, and yeah. upstairs we've got what we got. Soft play, yeah, for, yeah. Small, for smaller children. So that is it finished for the day. Oh, it's been a great day. It's been really, really crazy hot out, but um, awesome day in Canterbury. Good to spend some time with Tony, and uh, actually good to finally show you guys game base. Through which I did actually manage to pick up a few games, a few off my to get list, which is awesome. But if you want to see what I got, you'll have to watch my August pickups video, and yeah, you'll see the goodies. But anyway, guys, thanks for watching. Please feel free to like, comment and subscribe and I'll catch you all later.